welcome to another video. Walk on the wild side and I am here in the Happy Days Amusements here in Blackpool. We're just opposite the Central Pier and this section where we are here is CJ's Prize Bingo. Check them out if you come into Blackpool. Look at this, look at all these prizes here. Cuddly toy anyone? I don't play bingo myself by the way. <laughs> My mum played bingo. She used to go to uh, she used to go to the Palladium on Waterloo Road. She used to go to the Mecca. Well, actually, the Mecca. When when they went to the Mecca, that was like a special occasion. And she talked about the national and all that sort of thing. But I, went, I remember going to bingo once, and I went with her, and I got a book, you know. And I was too scared. I thought, I hope I don't win. I do not want to win. I don't even want to get a line because I'll be too scared to shout it out. That's, that's that's my experience. That was the Palladium <laughs> on Waterloo Road, which is now, um, yeah, I don't know what it is now. I think it's a gym or something like that. Uh, do you remember that, Pete? Just, just um, well, <coughs> the, show them the picture. Just, why you, yeah. Sort of leaning on it. <laughs> oh, okay then. Right, do you want to explain right, this then, Steve? Okay. Now, I just want to, uh, to show this on this video, exclusive. You're getting to see it on this. This, this photograph here is a print which I made myself of the photograph which I took in 2015, Electric Blackpool, as you can see down there. Uh, a famous photograph in Blackpool of Lightning, which went on to win an award in 2018. It won the Armet, the Royal Meteorological Society Weather Photographer of the Year Award. So it's quite an exclusive photograph, this actually. And I've had it uh, put into this mount, this nice mount, and I'm going to have it framed. Now, when I have it framed, I'm going to be giving this away in a competition on my channel. Now, I don't know how I'm going to do the competition yet, but all you have to do is make sure you subscribe to my channel. That's all you have to do so far. I'll have, I'll have to work it out how I'm going to do the competition. But this is going to be the first prize in the competition. So that is, I think it's a pretty good, I, I did say, I mentioned it a couple of videos ago, I think, that I was going to do a competition. Are you going to autograph it as well? Oh yeah, it's autographed. If you look down there. Oh, oh, the, there we go. Uh, and it's yeah. autographed as well. Yeah. So this is Blackpool's version of the Mona Lisa, isn't uh, it? It is a bit, yeah, actually. Yeah. And I'll probably have, when it's all nicely framed, I'll probably have like a little write-up on the back about when I took it and, and all that sort of thing and how it went on to win the competition. So that's going to be the first prize. So that's a, that's a nice first prize. When I get it framed. So, so all you have to do is to make sure that you subscribe. That's all you have to do so far. I'll try and work out. I'm going to have like second and a third prize as well. But that's the first prize. Anyway, um, got some gifts. Yeah, we've got some more gifts in this video. I'd just like uh, to say, while we're here though, yeah, we're doing a combined gift thing, uh, letters at the moment, aren't we, Steve? Yeah. We're doing the Crab Girls, the Crab Boys, and obviously Steve Walk on the Wild Side. Now, you know that normally Steve gets the most, don't you? And he's yeah. like quite, you know, embarrassed about it. <laughs> he's got nothing to be embarrassed this time. Look what the Crab Girls have ended up with. Unbelievable. They don't even exist. And look how many prizes they've got. So that's the crap girl stuff. That's mine and Pete's. Yeah. And that's that's Steve's Mia dropping the ocean today. Normally Steve gets loads, but this time I personally think the crap girls have been sending him to themselves. But we'll be going through it. If you've not heard about the crap girls, yeah, they're just like footballers' wives, they're jumping on the back of mine and Pete's uh fame. Remember guys to like and subscribe. No, 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 no. They don't exist. They don't exist. And certainly don't send them anything because they're like they're like pigeons. If you keep feeding them, they'll keep coming back. <laughs> anyway, we better get it won't take as long to do Steve's because he's not got that many this time. No, I do think it's really good that, that other people are getting <coughs> things sent to them rather than just me because like I say, I do feel a bit guilty. <laughs> and can you see how he's saying that through gritted teeth? <laughs> uh, anyway, point with no further ado. Let's go through what you've got. I've got a Harry Potter bag here. Look at that Harry Potter bag. Yeah, and there's a couple of things in here. I think what, one of these is for One's you. for me and one's for you. Um, they, uh, I don't know who sent it. They put, dropped them into me a couple of weeks ago. So this one's for me. It's got a card on there. <coughs> okay, so if you do yours I'll first, then I'll do mine afterwards. It actually feels like a picture. <laughs> it feels like a picture, I have to say. <laughs> <coughs> you have to excuse me. I've got a bit of a frog in my throat at the moment. Oh, this looks interesting. Oh, wow, look at that. Hey. 
Now then. Oh, that's nice, I know isn't what that it? Is. I think it's one of those diamond, is it? What do you call them? Picture? I've had one of these before. Diamond um, dart. Diamond dart. Now, I actually have a picture of these, the Kelpies. This is from the Falkirk Wheel. Um, and I actually went there, it was quite a while ago now, and I took a picture of them. I'm not sure, I don't think it's from my picture, but I know I did take a picture of it. But uh, yeah, that's the Kelpies there, so I'll... Uh, so who's it from? There's, there's a letter with it. We'll just have a look and see who it's from. I think it'll be in here, hopefully. So the Kelpies, very, very uh, nice picture there. Andy and Kerry. And um, a little gift all the way from Bonnie, Scotland. Falkirk, there you go, yeah. Yeah, so I actually visited Falkirk and I took a picture of the Kelpies. Spe I went there especially to get the picture because I'd seen them and I thought, I want to get a picture of them. Those horses there, it was absolutely amazing. I managed to get some good light as well. So there you go, that's nice. That, yeah, thanks very much to Andy and Kerry for that picture there. Do you want to just hold the camera and I'll open mine? So um, Chris is now going to open his. So I got one sent at the same time. So it'll be from Andy and Kerry again. And uh, I've got the same picture but from a different angle oh look at that yeah i think they're amazing you know the kelpies if you ever get a chance to go to Falkirk, go and check them out they're amazing there's also a canal there as well and uh, a lot yeah lindsay come over here come over here here you go just hold that and then there we go a bit of glamour showing it off now there we go she can make a nice model draped over a car couldn't she <laughs> really pretty so that's from andy and kerry again just a little gift for all uh all the way from bonnie scotland uh andy and kerry thank you very much and both of them are absolutely amazing aren't they thank you very much it's always are these handmade? uh yeah i think so yeah they look handmade don't they a lot of work's done into that they are good they are good aren't they so i should just uh Mm -hmm. Take the camera back now. And should, do you want to carry on with the rest of your stuff here? Yeah, do you want to take the camera over? Yeah. So I'm passing the camera over to Lindsay now. Okay, so we've got Lindsay on the camera now. So we sure have. Today. Probably a lot more steady. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. You won't cut his head off and stuff like that. Uh, I've got, what's this now? What's this we've got here? I think we've got, someone's trying to have it. I think this is an, what, what would you say that is? So let's have a look. Uh, it's more advertising stuff, isn't it? I think, I think, what do you think? Should we show this or, or not? No, <laughs> I don't no, know. A toy place? Orchard toys? No. It's just something I, I wouldn't bother myself. Something's just sending adverts We in. get people sending things in and I think they're trying to advertise for free. If, 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 I said we had someone sent from, from Caledonia, Scottish Caledonia, you know, like the travel companies and things like that. And I reckon if you want to advertise for a coach company, let me go on a trip and then I'll advertise it for you. What do you reckon? I reckon yeah, that's, it, I'm, that's I reckon, a good idea. I reckon, pick whoever, I reckon you should take all three of us on the trip. The boys out. Like the Jolly Boys outing. Oh no. I wouldn't wish that on any. The Jolly Boys outing, yeah. So, for those of you who have got these travel agencies who keep sending this up. That's not very nice, is it? <laughs> the Jolly Boys outing, I think that'd be a fantastic idea. Jolly? Are you Jolly? Oh, I am Jolly. Are you? We're not Pete Menstall like you, we're all jolly. <laughs> Are you going to wear long pants if we do that? Uh, no, no, I never can, wear can long pants. we do it in the winter when there's less light so we don't have as much time to spend together, yeah. sort of thing? That's not very nice, is it? <laughs> can you hear this, guys? It's just going to all fall out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true, bound to. <laughs> right, let's have a look at this one, shall we? Where's your teeth going? Oh, not the third of the arcade, I've done a lot of them in you. I think we've got a lot. Not much chocolate. Uh, hang on a second. This but, is from, I think I've had one of these before. Is it from Bendy Janet? Bendy I think Janet. it is. Bendy I've got Janet. some lemon dressing. And I think, oh, hang on. I've had one of these before. It's from Bendy Janet. Hi, Stephen. Your documentaries are awesome. Documentaries. Ooh, Can you do Janet. Watson Road one day, please? One end to the other. I have actually. 
I have done Watson Road. That's obviously Watson Road is the road that goes underneath the Pleasure Beach. But if you follow it all the way inland, it takes you to kind of Common Edge. Yeah, Common where edge. people live in Blackpool, basically. Yeah. Um, please say hi to Kenny the Sausage Dog. Hi to Kenny the Sausage Dog <laughs> and his humans in Adelaide. <coughs> it's it's from Australia. It's come all the way. No, it hasn't come from Australia, has it? It's just come from here. The orders come from Australia. The orders come from Australia. I'll, 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 I'll have to put it on my chips, won't I? <laughs> yeah. So thanks to Bendy Janet for that. So why, Steve, you've got to let us know. We're, we're intrigued. Why is she called Bendy Janet? Yeah. Is, Bendy? There a, is there a reason behind this? I don't know. Uh, but I know that I've had... Um, I've had... Bendy Janet. Before, but... Apparently he's had Bendy Janet. But we've got a lovely legs. We got a lovely legs, that's yeah. what it could be. Please, Bendy Janet, please put on the comments below why you're called Bendy Janet. Because you're intrigued. Yeah, I am really intrigued. And why aren't you subscribed to my channel? Because I want to have a Bendy Janet on my channel. Because <laughs> she's got taste. <laughs> yeah, I definitely want a Bendy Janet on, on my channel. <coughs> this is from Wayne and Sandra Paxford. Hi to Wayne and Sandra down there in Oxford. Long time fans of the channel. I never said show then, didn't <laughs> Well, it is a show, really, I suppose. Isn't it? Yeah. So I've got some postcards from Oxford. Check it out. I actually went to Oxford. Was it last year? Was it the year before? I don't know. And I went and did the, you know, it's Oxford. It's the university town, of course, isn't it? So I've got these nice postcards here. Look at that there. Oxford University, obviously famous around the world. Some nice photographs. You know, that's one of the things, you see, I like to take pictures and sometimes you've got to be up at the right time to get that picture. Look at that one there. You've got oh, to be beautiful. there at the right time if you want to get the right picture. So some nice pictures here on these postcards. Thanks very much to Wayne. Wayne and Sandra for those. Very, very nice. Thank you. Uh, so thank you very much. This one's quite heavy. It's all stapled as well. So. Ooh. I wonder what's in here. <laughs> I can't believe you let the crap girl beat you though. I I'm, 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 the crap girl that beat and walk on the wall side, that's unbelievable. We've that's beaten you as well. Oh, I know. I think I've got it. Ah, I think I've got some chocolate. Oh, look at that there, look. Cookie crumble. Ooh. Galaxy. Yeah, I do have a bit of a... A thing for galaxies. You got a sweet too, Stephen. I, I, I think you're more like a yeah. chocolate fetish. I've to always be had a sweet chocolate fetish. Yeah, I think you've got more of a chocolate fetish. The amount of chocolate you go ah. through. Oh, another galaxy. Look at this now. Smooth mint. Oh, oh I, I bet that's well. nice. Uh, mint chocolate. I like mint chocolate. The amount of people who commented on the amount he eats, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and how he's not fat is <laughs> unbelievable. But he does a lot of walking, doesn't he? Yeah, he that's walks true, everywhere. Yeah. Only on the wild side. Oh, yeah, on the yeah. other wild side. Oh, oh, very good. Very good. <laughs> oh, oh, no, no way. Oh, Look your favourite person. Picture of the Queen. There you go. It's an old one, isn't it, with the Queen? Yeah, I saw one with Prince, uh, Prince Charles. King Charles. King Charles, King yeah. Charles on it the other day. But it's still worth the same money. Uh, this is from George Smiley. Thanks very much to George Smiley. I think I've had chocolate off uh, the year before, haven't I? It likes to send us chocolate. It's trying to fatten us up. Yeah, and, and only uh, the fact you were, you had fish and chips, a wild side burger, and apparently you had an ice cream afterwards. I did have an ice cream afterwards as well, yeah. I couldn't believe it, yeah. Unbelievable. So thanks very much to George for these. I've also got a milk bar. That's another <laughs> one. <laughs> hey? Do I look like I'm putting them away? I don't know. I definitely think they're, they're trying to batter you up. I can't believe how much stuff you eat. Uh, right. Got a few more here to go. <clears throat> he's having to take his time this time, guys. He's not got that much stuff. <laughs> yeah, padding it out. Padding it yeah, he's padding it out because he wants the video to last longer. Yeah, this is interesting. Oh, look at this. <laughs> So this is a, <coughs> it's a DVD, is that a DVD? it's a DVD of Black Brother Illuminations <gasps> and it looks like when the Illuminations were all like, you know when they were proper bulbs? Yeah. Now, a lot of people say nowadays we have the LED Illuminations and they're all LED, low power, but they just don't seem to have that sparkle really, do they, that they used to have? I agree. 
you know, in the olden days, when they had to change all the The bulbs. 90s illuminations were so yeah. much prettier. And I remember when the tower was lit up and they had advertising on it. Mm -hmm. And they had the sponsorship with Yeah, Pepsi, and, didn't they, as yeah, well? Yeah, yeah, Pepsi. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. And all that sort of thing, so... And it was gold um, once as well, the tower. Do you remember when the Central Pier had wagon wheels on it as well? Wagon yeah. wheels Central Pier. Yeah, yep, I remember that. So I don't that. know why they stopped doing that, because it must have paid quite a bit of money towards the, mm -hmm. um, you know, to... Well, the to tower the, was gold as well, you know. At one Sorry? point, the tower was gold. Oh yeah, they, 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 yeah, they did that as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they've, they've done all sorts of things, mm -hmm. haven't they? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. The trouble is, a lot of it's gone all politically correct now, hasn't it? <coughs> <laughs> well, so this is from Deb and Steve in Stoke-on-Trent. I have quite a few fans in Stoke-on-Trent. All right, Duck. Uh, the first time. All right, Duck. All right, Duck. <laughs> so, so. A DVD first saw it in Price Busters. Price Busters took over Woolworths. The Wool <coughs> you know Woolworths when 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 Woolworths first closed the big Woolworths store, Price Busters took it over. Um, how long ago was that? But eight, maybe eight years oh. or something. Not that eight, um, eight, four. I don't know. Yeah. Price Busters was fantastic though. Yeah, but I remember the Woolworths store when it was proper. When it was all yeah. floors and everything. Yeah. Cafe, and everything, yeah. And don't forget they had the one down South Shore as well on Bond Street and Waterloo Road. That was a Woolworths as well, which became Hearts, and now it's been derelict. Hearts is where time, we used yeah. to get the Christmas decorations from. Yeah, yeah, the, the, mm -hmm. the shop that sold the Christmas yeah, decorations yeah. all year yeah. round, yeah. So is this useful for you, maybe, next time Ride the Lights, you could split screen the video with this video? Well, possible, yeah, yeah. Um, so I'll have a look at that and uh, see if I can do that. But yeah, like an old picture of the illumination. They said they're going to be down at the end of July, so I hope you have a good time when you come down. And that's Deb and Steve from Stoke on Trent. Thanks very much for that. The video's there, the DVD. <coughs> see what we've got here. It's warming up in Blackpool, you know, today it's, uh, it certainly if you're coming down over the next uh, few days or the weekend, it looks like the weather's going to be pretty good. It's, it is warming up a bit. It's meant to be really nice until Saturday morning and then Saturday afternoon it's supposed to be really nice again. I've got another one here. I think <laughs> it's another, I think it's another advertiser. It's RSPB. Someone sent me a, a for the, R I'm actually a member of the RSPB. Let's see if I can find my card. Can I find my card? I'm actually a member of the, I can prove it, I can prove it, look, there you go, I'm a member, that's my card for the RSPB, but I never go, I, I pay, I pay something like £40 a year, and that gets me into some of the reserves, but I haven't been to any of the reserves for a long time, so <laughs> <laughs> I'm paying them, I'm supporting them, which is good, because I do think it's a good cause, the RSPB, mm -hmm. But um, I don't really take advantage. I don't really go to. I like to go to. to you know, I, I like birds. Well, I, I love the birds, mm -hmm. and um, I like to. Go Including to the, the seagulls. Yeah, yeah, the, the <laughs> seagulls. Well, the seagulls are a little bit. You know, I just walked um, into a conversation saying Steve loves the birds. <laughs> yes. But we're not yeah. far from Martin Mir. Martin Mir is a massive um, RS. I think it's RSPB. Some of them are different. Yes. Yeah, Wildfire yeah. Reserve. Wow. Yeah. And then we've got Leighton Moss up, up the road near Lancaster, which is amazing. Uh, so yeah, I do like to go there from time to time. So uh, yeah. I don't know who sends these things, things, but uh, uh, there you go. Shout out to the RSPB. Right, last one. That didn't take long, did it, Steve? You do realise they're going to be here all day. night. They're going to be inundated with stuff now, aren't they? Yes, they yeah. sure are. Steve's flight. running out of shortbread, oh, everybody. Flight. Yeah. What's that? Martin Jaffa cakes. <laughs> well, don't mention Jaffa cakes, oh. for God's sake. Oh! Now that. Look at that. Oh! We like that, don't we? Thank you very much. I don't know who sent this, by the way. It doesn't. My phone's hiding here. It doesn't. <coughs> but it has here. Number one, you caused a diversion. Number two, you knocked the chips out of their hands. And number three, this time, two degrees to the left and you should be able to cover the lot of them. <laughs> I think that's a bit of a reference to the video I did a few weeks ago when I went to um, Mother Hubbard's Chippy and I tried to eat the fish and chips on the promenade, which was a... No chance. Bad major, <laughs> major, major fail. Evil, evil. It was, it was a bad idea, but I don't have a name on that. 
I'm afraid. There's no. I d if you could let me know in the comments who, who sent it, I don't think that there's. I can't see a, a name on it. But thanks very much. The amount of people who walked out the burger bar well. with a burger in the hand, yeah, mm -hmm. and literally the uh, the the seagulls have gone down the street and took them. It took me absolutely ages to train them to do that. Absolutely <laughs> ages. You train them. Yeah, you, I've trained, are you I've, taking credit? I trained them to do that, so they have to come back and buy another one. <laughs> Do you not feel sorry for them and go, oh, here's a free one? What? <laughs> <laughs> I love your sense of humour. Well, you know, I am Northern. Oh, yeah, that's true. So there you go, that's it. Yeah, thanks very much to everyone who's sent in a, a gift. Um, and also, I'm just looking at the Crap Girls prizes. Uh, the, well, gift, should I say. They, they, they look, I mean, oh, <laughs> just look at this over there. Look, look at them all. Look. There's so many of them. There is so many of them. There's only one that I can actually see that's useful for them. There's, there's somebody bought you a mop. <laughs> Someone's got us a mop. Somebody's got you a mop. I don't know why they got you a mop, but somebody's got you a mop. So this is all the Crap Girls presents. There we go. Yeah, so there you go. Thanks for everyone who sent... Uh... Oh, I've got one more question, Steve, yeah? <coughs> no, it's not a loaded question. I've, I've been asked quite uh, often now. <coughs> Excuse me, when is the uh, calendar coming out? I'm gonna, oh yeah, we mentioned that last time. I'm gonna bring it out earlier because I yes. think I need to get it out earlier because usually it's September or late September by the time it comes out. That's a bit late. I've been, so. I've been asked if uh, people are coming in August, will it be available for August? Now I yeah. said I don't Actually, know, yeah. and I would put you on the spot on a video to actually yeah. make a decision on that. So, hey guys, he's now on the spot. <laughs> well, I'm trying it's to see if I can get it done. It? Right? It's surely. Yeah, well, at least we'll put the order in, I guess. Yeah, I, I do need to get it out earlier, so I am aiming for August, yeah. Okay. And you must really is... love visiting Higgett. Yeah. This is, is exclusive now, guys. Yeah, you've heard it here first. The calendar is going to be available from August. They can all be, they can be picked up from all good retailers, i.e. the Burger Bar and the Bingo. And uh, don't forget, you can also get them from Steve's site itself, yeah? But if you do buy them from me or from Pete, £2.50 of each calendar sold goes directly to... A quick one on to... that, bit, bit, bit quick on that. If you buy them from me, you've got to get them in before December. Because I'm December I'm closed, I won't be here, go to Bali, I'm out of here. Okay, then. <laughs> and I, sh I shut at the beginning of November anyway, yeah? But they will be available from me or from Pete. And every time you buy one from here, £2.50 of that goes directly to uh, Brian House. Or if, you're not, if you can't come down here and pick them up physically, you can get them from Steve's website. And obviously Steve will give you the relevant details of that. Mm -hmm. yeah. From August, apparently. August, not putting yeah. you under pressure or anything on that one. <laughs> from August, OK? Possibly. No, 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 no. We don't do possibly here, definitely. Anyway. Thanks to you, Maestro. Okay, yeah, so that's it. <laughs> Thanks to everyone for, for, for sending stuff in. And, uh, don't expect any videos of Steve for the next two weeks. He's in doing making a calendar. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel because it's the, it's the minimum requirement to win the competition. And this is going to be the first prize. I'm going to get it framed. This channel he's talking about, okay? Not okay. that channel. This no. channel. Not this no. channel. This channel. I took him out the frame. It's okay. So. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It doesn't cost anything. I know some people are a little bit reluctant to subscribe sometimes, aren't they? But it doesn't cost anything to to subscribe. So I'm going to be sorting the competition out soon. I'll be mentioning it again on my video. So look out for that. And uh, I'll, I'll also announce what I'm going to give away as a second and the third prize. And uh, that's it for this video. Uh, if you like it, hit the like button and also hit subscribe. Yes, hit subscribe. And tick the bell. Do I normally say this at the end of the day? No, no. no, no. <laughs> and a shout out for your camera lady. Yeah, and a shout out to the crap girls. Get them followed. I'll put a link in the description. <laughs> don't do it. Don't, <laughs> don't, don't, don't do it. They're not real. They don't exist. <laughs> See you on the next video.